Um, I am doing a painting today for a memorial service. Um, one of my great aunts passed away and I was tasked with doing a painting. Um, so this is the first part of it. Um, I have different colors of white and blue and green mixed in here that I mixed with garage door lubricant. Same as what I always use. Um, and then this is gold layered with all the different whites as well. So what I wanna do is I just wanna create like a very neutral background with gold going through. I think I've done this once before. And I mixed way too much paint, so I decided why not make a mess of it. Okay guys, um, so I'm going on to the second phase of this. I'm using the stencil. I really liked this like stencil that I found that was like a flower made of butterflies. I feel like it's kind of, I don't know, symbolic of like family, could be. And then the lone butterfly fleeing, going off to Butterfly heaven, I guess. <laughs> I did a test run on this and I used lotion because the last, um, are you shea butter lotion? Um, because the last test I did, did, I didn't think was indicative of how the lotion would react because, um, I used water too. And so I wanted to see like if I used lotion without water, just like on this one, what would happen? And something weird happened with it. It got like gummy as I was like rinsing it off. It turned like, I don't know, like in the little pill balls of glue almost. And then they wouldn't come off the canvas and I was trying to like tweeze them off and let, it was just a mess. So, you know what? I'm back to using mayonnaise because this is tried and true and um, it works. It's easy to rinse off. So why am I trying to find another solution when I have one. It works. It's a little creepy, but sometimes creepy works. Sometimes creepy is what you need, I guess, apparently. So, Hip hip hooray for being creepy today, you guys. Plus what, what would a painting from me be if it wasn't just completely out there? But I really love this stencil.
I'm not being shy with the mayonnaise because why? I feel like the more I put on, the easier it comes off. doesn't run or bleed underneath the stencil like the Dawn Soup did. Guys, literally, I hate to say it, it's like the perfect ingredient. Creepy, but I don't know, it's on there for like 20 minutes and you rinse it off, so. If it works. Why fight it? Why fight it? I'm using flat white this time. No primer in it. Um, Okay, you guys, I'm ready to rinse off the moment of truth. guys so here this one is um dry i'm really happy the way it turned out i really like this stem how it's like i don't know candy cane reminds me of something from like alice in wonderland some of these turned out okay like this one but then some really turned out great Most, for the most part, they they all turned out pretty great. I love these in here and that are kind of paisley. And then you've got a lot of gold. I think it has a little bit more gold than I would have liked. But um, it kind of adds, I don't know, some dimension to it, I guess. So, um... I don't know, let me know what you guys think. I'm excited um, to bring it to this memorial and see what everyone in my family thinks. 
So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.